folks, this is Rick Macy Pumping and Refrigeration. We got today we're gonna put a stop leak in a refrigerator. Oh, somebody's birthday. Okay, so let's take a look at what we got here. We've got an LG bottom freezer. Somebody was here before, put Freon in it, said it needs to be checked, leak, stop put in it. So here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna go ahead and run you through the procedure. It's already got a service valve on it. We're gonna hook up to the Freon. Okay. Turn it on, purge out the air. Good check it. And yeah, it's in a vacuum. Just a little bit. So we're gonna put a stop leak in it today. This is the best I can find so far. It's called Easy Seal. Okay. So it comes in this package. Top off here. That's what it looks like. Right here. So this is the procedure. It goes on to the low side. Screw this on, like so. Okay, then you put your gauges on here, like so. Push the air out. A little bit of pressure in there. And there it goes. And see, it disappeared into the system. So, this is how you add a stop leak. And this brings up above the zero, that settles down. And that will. Hopefully stop the leak. It's going down, down about 18. Should go down around two above zero. And that would be a fine charge. And we check here, we're getting some heat on the condenser. Okay. Ten, still coming down. It'll slowly go down as the liquid mixes with the freon gas. So that's it. That's the procedure. If somebody's done some major work on this unit, it has a high oh, no cap on it. I have to come up with a couple caps here because it could possibly leak out of there. That's the filter dryer. So we're about on eight. It's coming down slowly. 